In this video, I'm going to show you how you can allocate more VRAM for your Radeon, Vega 7 and 8. So right here, we only have 512 dedicated GPU memory. We're going to change that to 2 gigabytes, or you can change that to 4, 8, or even 16 if you wanted to, but that wouldn't be useful. Go ahead and restart your computer and hit delete to get inside your BIOS. Here, go to the advanced menu, go to AMD CBS, and then go to NBIO common options, and then GFX configuration, and then iGPU configuration, and here select UMA specified, and here UMA frame buffer, and in here you're going to change the UMA frame buffer size to whatever that you like. I would recommend sticking to 2 or 4 gigabyte as there won't be any performance gains going beyond that limit. Go ahead and save and exit. And now we're going to go back in the task manager to see if those changes actually took effect. Here we can see that now we have 2 gigabytes of dedicated GPU memory for a Ryzen 5 5500 GT. Just because now we have 2 gigabytes of dedicated VRAM, now we have less system memory. Now we're only left with 13.9 gigabytes of system memory and the available memory that we have is only 10.4 gigabyte. So I would recommend doing this only if you have 16 or more gigabytes of memory to begin with. Now we're going to run Forza at 1080p, very low settings. Here now we can see our Forza Horizon 5 is using 1964 megabytes. So that's almost close to 2 gigabytes of VRAM. So our changes are in effect. The game runs pretty smooth. We're averaging about 65 FPS. It will go higher once we get on the highway. I hope you find this video useful. If you did, please hit the like button and subscribe for more content like this. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.